Moving along with the new year. New year, okay. Um, what is it? It's not next week. The week after, mm-hmm. uh, John and I from the We Don't Know show on a Wednesday, mm-hmm. we'll be going to bet in Excel. And you and Chris will be doing this show. Yeah. The Wild Show on a Thursday. Yes, I will be. And we will phone in. As if the phone is going? If the phone is going. It's not really going at the moment. Mm. Um, what we what we can um, what we can do is uh, sort that out. <laughs> over, the next two, over the next... Or the two baked bean tins and a piece of string will come in very handy. <laughs> but at the same time, J.D., you see, mm. what occurs to me is we should also plan on the basis that nothing happens at all. Right. Because <laughs> this, is, this is down to you and Chris. That's just this show. <laughs> <laughs> if, um, if John and I, for some reason, only phone in once, mm. or not at all, mm. but we've told you what we hope to, to report on, mm-hmm. um, you could uh, re- repeat what you said last year, or you could just find the information from somewhere else, I or, could find or, the information. Or make it up. You could send me photographs. Not, yes. Not off carpets this year, please. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> of a stand or something like that, and I can describe it. That's true. That's good radio. Yes. Yes. Well, uh, but we'll, ch- we'll we'll try and get as much as we can together on the mm. Wednesday, because the Wednesday's the first day of it. But we'll be doing the We Don't Know show. Mm. So we'll try and get as much photographs and everything together as we can. Mm-hmm. And then you will have a choice on the we Thursday. Have a choice. Yes. Wow. I don't get a choice very often, but this sounds intriguing. <laughs> so you'll either have live radio phone-ins, mm-hmm. or bits you prepared earlier, yeah. or bits and pieces of sound from other sources, mm-hmm. or some combination of it all. Mm-hmm. So I'm sure you and Chris will be able to put some sort of show together. Mm-hmm. Yes, I think, I I think that will work quite well. Yes, we can scrape something together. But it'd be nice to hear your dulcet tones on 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 the re- on the radio. Yes, well, I, I think something will something will work that yes. we'll be able to phone in. Okay, we'll, we'll work that out. We've got a couple of weeks, haven't we? Yeah, for that. Yeah, it's two weeks two weeks ahead. So, uh, shall I be really technical? Yes, and I say it's on the twenty third to the twenty sixth of February of uh, this month. This yes. Okay. So you've it, got you've got some, well all right well let's start let's because you've obviously looked it up. I've just looked it up. I've got the website. So what do you think it's all about? And then perhaps I'll join in. What and, do you think? And, well, um, I think it's um, a technical thing. Yeah. All right. Which is probably trying to get the future of technology into today's world. Yes. Is that? That's pretty good. that's fa- that's pretty good. Very good. Um, I, I haven't been there, folks. I don't, I, um, you know, no, but we were there last year and the year before, so hmm. we're, you, you're gradually getting the the, the impression of I'm it. Getting the impression, yes. Um, it's educational. Yes. So I, I think it's training. But the bet is British education and training technology. Right. So the the training aspect is there, but it is pretty educational. So a, a lot of schools will be there, and some universities or FE. It's not, you know, it's not, it's not just schools, in other words. There's quite a right. wide range of pe- pe- people there. And a very strong technology. I would say much, much more technology presence than at any university show that, that exists or gathering, conference, whatever. Uh, the, there's is a, it, a lot of uh, any, anywhere tech companies. In, in that for disabled people? Well, this is what we're going to discover. Mm-hmm. Um, until last year, I would have said very confidently, yes, there was. They, 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 they call it special educational needs. Mm-hmm. And there's always been a theatre and a special area. Mm-hmm. And that was our first target last year, was to get there. Um, mm-hmm. But it turned out last year there wasn't really um, mm-hmm. a, a focus for it all. And that seems to be down to budgets, that schools have been very pressured for uh, what what kind of money they've got available for different things. But this year there is. Mm-hmm. Um, I think they're calling it neuroscience as well as um, special educational needs. So they're going to concentrate on different forms of communication. 
Why you? Because you have two friends with you, which could benefit from that sort of information. Well, yes, yes. yes. So that'd be quite good to re- report back on that. Well, that'll be the first one. Mm. Um, and John, John will be with me. Yes. And yeah, I mean, like, like he's Chris, the correspondent there. He is the main correspondent for <laughs> yes. that. And like, like Chris, visibility is an issue. So both, mm. both of them, mm. I think, have have for a long time been interested in voice technology because mm. they inter they interface I'm I'm getting into Mm. techie talk now Mm -hmm. the computer interface that Mm. they use Mm -hmm. mostly is voice and it has been for a long time I'm I'm waiting for the voice which will take over the complete show Uh, this show (laughs) yes (laughs) we just tell you what we want want to say and walk off bye bye well that may be covered as well yes never know because the chat robot the artificial intelligence Mm. can work as text Mm. But can it work as voice? Mm-hmm. And will it just analyse what what the Wild Show has said previously, and um, gradually do another one? Mm-hmm. I'm sure that's possible. Um, Adobe are going to be there. Mm-hmm. They advertised a couple of years ago mm-hmm. that they were working on a artificial intelligence voice simulation uh, project, but um, they they haven't actually delivered anything. I don't think. They might have done it secretly. But anyway, we'll just talk to them about simpler things when we get there. Um, but the, the, other, the other place we'd like to get to is uh, the STEAM village. Uh, STEM is science, technology, engineering and uh, mathematics. But they, they advertised it was going to become STEAM. There was going to be arts there. Mm-hmm. Um, and I would have thought radio is a very strong contender to be part of that because voice is now mainstream voice you know like Alexa and Cortana and various other ones Um, but I I think radio technology and that's where that's where the universities are going to be present as well because the a lot of the schools radio is also available for for universities or colleges whatever so there's going to be lots of stuff in in that area so I think that's the second place we'd head to so we might phone you, J.D., twice, for twice. sure. Well, wow. Once once from the special educational needs spot, mm-hmm. and then from the steam village. Okay. And I can see through the window that Chris has arrived. He has, yes. So we might but let this, him in. If somebody wants to look it up ahead of schedule, just look at betshow.com. Betshow.com. Yes, and you, uh, this is where I'm getting my information from. Okay. Chris, we've worked yeah. out when we get to bet. Well, that's to say when John and I get to bet. Yeah. Our aim is to go to the special educational needs area. Yeah. That wasn't there last year. And not. Yeah. But we'll try and find it. And then we'll go to the steam village where the Dalek was. Yeah. We'll see if the BBC have turned up. Where I got photographed with the Dalek. You did. <laughs> <laughs> that, that was their contribution. Chris, but, um, when you when you see the Dalek, can you get his autograph? <laughs> um, probably not. Uh, no, the, there is arts in STEM, obviously, and the BBC would be if they if they were there, they would make it all very clear. But anyway, we could ask them, perhaps. But then. If we can, within the two hours, we'll then try and find Russell Prue and the radio. I think it's net support, but we'll have the stand number by then. He'll be on a stand somewhere or another. Uh, but if, if we don't manage to get that far, Chris, would you make something up during the <laughs> show based on your knowledge from last year? Yes. Well, that's easy for him. He could do he that. He makes the whole show up. Well, I've got the photo from last year. All right. That's true. So that's our backup. Our producer is very worried is that the he? phone might not work. I'm only worried that they don't get the makeup right down the other end. Well, I have a solution to the phone not working. Oh, uh, yes. Go, go that's on. what I'm doing today. Okay, that's good. You're going to phone yourself and see if you reply. 
<laughs> no, I'm going to get JD to phone me. Oh, okay. And I'm going to plug my iPhone into the desk. Ah, right. So the fact that the official phone is a little bit on the blink... Yeah, we... Shouldn't worry us too much. No, I'm going to try this and see if it works. So, hence I've got two phones. Oh, right, so you have. <laughs> OK, well, we'll get to that later on. He's got three, you can get mine as well. OK. Head to the <laughs> no, because <laughs> I need to ring you. <laughs> OK. OK. Uh, 